Hey there, welcome back to Summer Sunrise. This is Jeffrey here at Rio Restaurant. I'm here with Aubrey Wagner from the Grand Lodge of Peak 7 and uh, young Owen. Owen? Yeah. Can you and, look at the camera? And Owen's wearing a John <laughs> Deere sweatshirt, so he's a redneck in training. <laughs> He is. Yeah. yeah. Now, we come you, from the Midwest. We oh, had to represent. That's right. Now, you, yes. are, are you from a farming heritage? I'm not really, yeah. but um, I, I my, did, my dad is. I did a little growing up in Humboldt County many, many years ago. Uh, now, the Grand Lodge of Peak 7, located right as the name suggests on Peak 7. Steps from the Independence Chairlift. Must be beautiful right now. Yeah, but they have some snow on the peaks up mm -hmm. there, I'm imagining. They had it yesterday, so yeah. I wouldn't think. You, I mean, Owen can barely contain he's, his enthusiasm. I know, he's looking at the peaks right now. Yeah, he is. <laughs> staring <laughs> off into the distance. I can, I, you know what? I can just feel the disdain. I, let's, I, talk, <laughs> let's talk a little bit about what's happening at the Grand Lodge. You know, it, it's an interval ownership, five stars, and, and what that means is you can live like a millionaire without actually having to be a millionaire. Right. You can, you can, you can stay at a five-star resort, you know, relish in all of those beautiful amenities, mm -hmm. um, and then have it to be affordable, which, you know, luxurious, five-star yeah. affordability doesn't usually go hand in hand, but you do. You pay for it because you're paying for the time that you're going to use. No, you know, granted, you know, I'm, I'm terminally insecure, but it's really disconcerting having someone just totally ignore me like your son. <laughs> Welcome to parenthood. I guess so. I guess so. That's yes. how. I get that every day, all day. Really? Yeah, sometimes. Unless he needs something. If, if you yes. were my mom, I'd be fixated on you. Oh, I, yeah, I'd use, yeah, flowers every day, love. I do all the... Did I'd you do that the, for your mother? No. Um, now, here's the deal. Let's talk about learning a little bit more about the property at the Grand Lodge. Five Star, as the name suggests, granite countertops, uh, amenities galore, the grotto, indoor, outdoor aquatics. But if someone wants to learn more about it, yeah, find out if it's for them. Yeah, you know, you can visit us on property. Mm -hmm. um, the gondola is not running anymore, so nope. you definitely have to drive up. Best thing to do is call the number on the screen, mm -hmm. set up an appointment. Um, we have 40 plus agents ready to kind of peruse around property with you, kind of show you what we're talking about. Right. And we have a location here on Main Street as well. Yeah. So. Well, you know, and it makes total fiscal sense because, let's face it, you know, the taxes here to, to keep a home here in right. Summit County, it's very expensive because you might be using it for two weeks a year and for the other 50 weeks of the year, you have to pay taxes, right. maintenance, upkeep. This you only buy the weeks you're going to use. You're going to buy the weeks you're going to use, so that's what you're, you know, you're, you're paying for, but you also can use it 365 days a, a year. Yeah. Okay. So that's huge. I mean, for the front range people that are here, it's you don't have to just come on your week. You can use the river resort all year round. Yeah, let's clarify that. So here's the deal. Say you own a week in December right. and you're skiing here in February. You're living in the front range or just visiting whatnot. Right. You go up, there's parking there. You can use the facilities. Uh, you, it's, it's so you, even though you're not staying there, you can use the amenities. And that makes to in total that's sense. It's huge for, yeah. you know, ski season when mm -hmm. we're coming up on that. And, you know, people to, to sit in the hot tubs and have a, have a hot toddy yeah. while well, everyone else is sitting on I-70 wondering sure. when the yeah. line's going to end. Um, you know, it's it's awesome for that. And that works with your family. Uh, you know, your parents, Patty and Neil, they bought a unit. And now you and your family, uh, you, uh, young Enos and your husband, <laughs> Bubba, can go up and, and use nice. the aquatic center, right? Yes. You know, okay. it's nice because it's passed down. It's, mm -hmm. you know, it's deeded. It, deeded. And mm -hmm. you can, so it's not fractional. I mean, it's not fractional, but it's, what's the other not deeded, but... Whatever. I have no idea. It I, can be passed down for generations. You went to college. I didn't. I, mm -hmm. yeah. I, I'm a little distracted, I guess. Yeah, I'm a little distracted. I know. I you am, keep looking at him like, I, is I he just want, You know what? I mean, let's face it. How, how, often, how often is a young kid on TV? I think it's me. Uh, you know, there again, I'm... I'm, I'm just, you're, you're intimidating. I'm inclined to insecurity, but I think it's because we need... Nervous. Anyway, check out the Grand Lodge of Peak <laughs> 7. And the beauty of this amenity, not only does it make fisc a fiscal sense, but it's locally owned and operated, and the owners and the staff give back to the community in a big way. They so. do, and they're, they're great to their employees and really? great to the they families. Really? They treat you well? Yeah, yeah I've yeah. been with them for a long time. Really? So, All yes. right. Well, good. They're hope, great. They have, hope they have a good health plan. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, maybe... maybe, maybe. Get, uh, get some Enos, you know, some personality counseling. We'll be back with more. You're watching Summit Sunrise. Stay with us here on TV8 Summit. We're at Rio Restaurant. Don't go away. We'll be Can back. Look at the camera and say bye. Nope.